Hello, welcome back. Last time I learned that even numbers exist, and so do uneven ratios, and they all work pretty much intuitively. Uh, apparently I'm in a world called open now. By the way, I don't think these go anywhere. They're just, like, thematically consistent with the, uh, the, uh, what the world is about. Anyway, so, uh, open. Little world. Not a lot of things in it. Maybe we'll get it all done today. Uh, oh, okay, so I'm here in a recursive space, got it. I need to somehow exit south into this. I think the way to do that is to embed that and that. Other way around. Um, can I do it the other way around? I'm not sure I can. Okay, well if you're there, and you are- oh! Oh, this is weird. So if I push this down, that happens, but if I walk... Hmm, same thing happens. It still pushes. Right. What's it pushing into? Like, what does this even mean? I guess... So this one comes out and replaces this one, this one comes out and replaces this one, and that just continues up the chain to infinity. Okay, it kind of makes sense. So what do I do about this? There's a closed edge at the top of you, and also I could push you out to space, but I don't really want to... Oh, but! Does that make an edge? No. No. Okay. Okay. Uh... So, yeah, so doing this is still just going to go to space. Right, um... You're trying to show me something. But I haven't yet guessed what that something is. So pushing in is a higher priority than eating. And I wish it weren't. So yeah, I just have to discover some action I can take. Wait, hang on. If I put this against a wall there, and the behavior's the same, and that has a... that... So it's against me now, but then I can't push it? Okay, but I replace it, of course. What? All right, what do I need to discover? Oh, there we go. I made a wall. Okay, that's all it was. Just put that against a wall. No new discovery. Just apply old concepts and, you know. Okay, got it. Makes sense. So, recursive space. Same thing here. Just do that and this. Okay, cool. Just took me a bit to catch on. Uh, so, Patrick, go there. Got that going on, so to get a south wall... I would like this inside this, I think. But I need a south wall for that to happen already. Well, hang on, but I... If I push it outside... Well, that would change recursion. However, now this is a south wall. And in order to get into you, you need to be outside here. Okay, so that just swaps those. It's confusing, but sort of makes sense. Alright, um... So... What are my possibilities? I don't think I can do anything with space. Now, hang on. Right, there's a there's an open side here, so that's how I can put you inside that. Why was that going to be good? Because I can push this out of here and then have access to it because it's against the south wall. There we go. Okay. All right. So we've gotten to the point of the game where it's remixing old challenges and making them harder. Because no new mechanics are being taught yet, just stuff I already knew. Uh, so sure, that's cool, that gets me a wall, but I can't use it on this. 
Oh, that ate it, though. I didn't expect that to happen, and it doesn't help me. Okay. Uh, so I really need the yellow to be south of the blue. I don't really have the space to do that. But then, how does the green come into the picture? That goes inside there. I can do it the other way around, like this. Is that useful? I think so. Yes, because if everything is all inside itself, then I can put it in this little one space and... Uh... Oh, right, and then I'm just there. Great, okay. Right, so putting the blue and the green just served to compact two things into what would fit in a one tall space. Uh, okay. So a little bracket here, a big bracket here. I need to walk in here and push this this way. And that can be done straightforwardly like this. However, I feel like I'm falling into a trap doing that because I'm never getting this green out, and that needs to be my other block up there. So, I need to enter you while still having access to being able to push you into one of these spaces. Probably means I want this in here on the bottom boundary. I don't think this is right. Let's see what happens, though. Maybe I'm just not thinking of it right. Because this is here, but that's in the corner now. So, no, that's not right. Okay, so, I mean, these are the only two blocks. One of them goes here. The other one goes... There. Uh... Ah, now you can come north out of the green thingy. But not if you're against the south wall. Okay, how do I have two things liberated after having pushed this? Okay, that puts you in green. Yeah, so what? This is no good, you're against the south edge. You're never gonna eat, be able to eat. Can I eat? Well, even if I do, what good would that do? So yeah, I can exit here and push this, but you're stuck there. Oh. I liberated you, which is cool, but doesn't really matter. Nope, this is all stuck. Way, no, I can't do anything with that. I mean, I can, oh. But if I've done this, let me push you over. Okay, so if I can eat blue with orange, and how would that happen? I don't think it would. Oh, however, so if this is on the edge. Oh, check it out. Look at this sneaky little spot. All right, that manufactures a an edge of sorts, and I can still get everything back. Okay. <laughs> Lots of possibilities. That was the one that ended up being the right one. Ooh, these are super tricky. Five out of four. That's more than one, so therefore the lock opens. All right, three levels of rec... Oh, no, infinite levels of recursion, but I gotta unpack them. Okay, so just green into blue. Oh, okay. And then green into green? Wait, hang on. Green into... But, but orange is where the stuff is. What's, what's this? This is green. Okay, infinite greens. 
So I can only push out. No pushing in and no entering, and that's space. What? So I can exit. It's just a matter of like, which thing do I unpack when? So this was one, two. I'm going to be one level deeper to unpack. So I'm going to be in blue and unpack orange, it sounds like. Because then I can exit to here. No, it's the other way around. I want to be in green and unpack blue. In orange and unpack green. In orange and unpack green. Probably. In blue and unpack orange. In green and unpack blue. But then that's blue again. No, now there's nothing in orange. So things need to ultimately come out of orange. If in green I unpack blue, orange is out there. With blue outside it. Ah, what if I unpack green and then blue? Is that better? Yes, because now I can... No, everything's in blue. If I put orange outside of blue... Can't put blue outside of blue, that's space. Okay, so I ended up in blue. Where did I start? I started unpacking in green. Okay, I'm gonna start unpacking in orange. Come out of here. And I'm never coming back in. So, uh, exit orange, unpack orange. Exit blue, unpack orange and blue into orange. No. If I unpack green now into green, then I've set up a recursive space and then I don't go to orange, so no. So blue is empty, I'm never using that again. I do at some point want orange and orange. And green is already there. Okay, so that's... That is confusing. I don't know exactly what I did. Just kind of fiddled around until it worked. That's what I did. Okay. Uh, wait, this is the same thing. But somehow must be different. Oh, the goal is in blue now. What? Okay, so that probably means, yeah, that I want to start there. Uh, what? If I unpack blue from here, and I can exit orange, I think I'm actually good. I need to go here, enter blue, push that orange to the right, and then that does it. Okay, okay, that worked. Ooh, there's a purple layer now, and blue with my face on it. Okay, I wanted to start one above where the goal was. This is trying to make sure I understand what I was doing. Um, so like I'm pulling, you know, cards out of the middle of a stack, so now I have a stack of three that point to each other, and then the purple that's on its own now. Here in blue, if I would unpack everything, I would never return to blue, so I don't want that. I can unpack purple, putting it in green, which I think sounds okay. Then if I push that out of green, that goes to a goal, which sounds great, and I don't think I need green anymore? So I'm coming out to orange. Then I just need to put this here, exit, push that to the south, and I'm good. Okay. Still can't... Uh... Ah, of course, because that was on a goal. Okay, so just swap these things around a little bit. Still can't explain what I did. Um, 
Right, those two being next to each other was crucial, so I need to actually push that to the this way. Okay, still can't explain what I did, but at least I understand enough to operate on it. <laughs> there are a lot of things like that in this game. Okay, you're an orange void. Green with a goal in it. Okay, pretty sure I want green in orange. And blue probably also in there. And orange probably here so I can get some north leverage after I do that. Uh, oh, green, you're, uh, you're in an okay spot. I can operate on you there. I need to recenter that green. Can I still? Mm, yes. Yes. Okay, that's all I needed. Great. Just think ahead and nope, no real problem here. Okay, so chamber there. Place for thing. Only one needs to end up on one of these. And we have this weird bottleneck right here. That is a weird bottleneck. That means I need to store something in the chamber, push it over, enter the chamber, push it out. And the chamber itself doesn't go. So what goes in the chamber is you and uh, you. And you. And I don't need to store it in beforehand, so I think this is just a matter of this. And... Okay, I can still do it from here. My plan changed a little bit, but it still works out. There we go. Okay, great. Cool. Alright, what are you? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Highly recursive space. Oh, that's fun. I can just change the side of that that it's on. Um, what I need to... Oh, what I need to... Uh, uh, I need you to... Ah! That's... Fine? Oh, no, that's space. Uh, what? No. Uh... Push this way? Yes, push that way. Okay, if you say so. Huh? What? <laughs> Let's see that in ASCII mode. That's... <laughs> not very informative! Whoa! Oh, oh geez, okay, I went to space. Okay, this is a mode where ASCII is like... Way less readable than the other one. Okay, I, I want to bail out here. <laughs> Yikes! Wow! Okay! <laughs> Oh, what is this? What the... Oh, that's... Oh, we're having some performance consequences here. A few too many quads to draw. Ah, uh, okay. Whoa, hang on. So some of these are pointers. Ooh, yeah. Somehow my computer, or the way that this game renders graphics, just... is a little too much for my computer. Oh, jeez. Okay, so Hall of Mirrors. I don't know what's happening. Dying, I'm here now. Uh, ah! Uh? Why does this happen? Like, what is what? This is a... Okay, so each of... Each cell... This is a 3x3 three three with... E 3x3, three three, each cell is a pointer to the enclosing container. Okay. And with one uh, blank space in it. Okay. Okay. It makes sense. So I can pull one out like this. I'm going to have to pull a whole bunch of these out. If I pointer here, I just come out there. If I pointer here, then I shuffle one of those there. I can get one out. I think this will kind of just work out. I should be able to unpack. I might end up one short. Uh. Oh. Uh. Uh, what? I need more than I have. Okay, 
I made a T-shape. Yeah, I still need two more than I have. I don't think I know how that's going to happen. I think at this point it's... no. Okay, well I got you. But I'm still short one. How would I get one more? Wait, maybe I can do something from down here. Oh, check it out. This is how. Right, of course, because I can push in from there. Oh, that's... Wow. Okay, so this should perform a bit better now. Yes, much better. <laughs> Oops, don't do that. Whoa. That was... that was something. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's go in here. Flip! Okay, so things that might be literally mirrored. Oh yeah, we got backward going stuff. Okay, reversed on the, oh yeah, yeah, there's, there's that shine. Shows reversed in the x-axis. Okay, so if I go in here, well yeah, I'm still just there. What does ASCII say about it? Whoop, there's a, a slash flashing. Okay. I understand. Go out here to arrive there. And yeah, I can look in the inner thing for a preview about where I'll arrive. Okay, sure. I mean, that's how that would work. All right, so similar formats. I'm gonna want to enter not that side. I can't. Um, if I go in here though, yeah, it puts me there. Now I exit this. That seems like a problem. No, because I enter. Right, okay. Ah! Uh, <laughs> this is much less intuitive to think about. It's fine though, I just have to stop and puzzle it out. And yeah, again, this is a place where, like, ASCII is way less readable. So off-centeredness with this, I mean... It looks like I just do the... Ah, right, but no, because that gets pushed. That's why I don't just do that. So I need... To end with that... Wait, what? Oh, can I flip a block like this? I can. Okay, I see. Oh no. Okay, we got some real statefulness going on. I can mirror blocks. Oh dear, and there's totally going to be vertical mirroring. Right now, just horizontal. Okay, so the mirror is in here. That's a that's a mirrored pointer. Oh, fun. Okay, mirrored pointer. And there's enough room, there's really basically zero choice here. The only thing I can possibly do is that, however... Wait. Wait. Why is... Okay, I just have to do it twice because what I actually need is just leftward leverage. The mirroring is not the interesting action here. I mean, it's interesting, but it's not the, the one relevant to solving the puzzle. Just kind of gets in the way. All right. Uh, okay, so horizontal mirror, recursive space. Wait, this is... Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Um, mirror whatever, however you want. I really just need to mirror this, and that's it, I think. And this. So you'll be going here, you'll be going here, you'll be going here, and you don't get mirrored. No, you're no good for... No, you go here, you go here, yes. But I still have a packing issue? Why are these shiny? Oh, because they've been mirrored. So just... So that I know. Yeah, okay, so they get the shine because they were mirrored. Ah. And in that representation, that just means that the, the inner space is unmirrored, but it's going to show as mirrored because... 
because it is. Uh, okay. So, um... I need to pack you in here, you in here, and then... Remirror things as necessary. Okay, so I unmirrored you. I'm gonna have to remirror you. That is not the way around that I want that. This is, I think. And mirroring, I assume, flips everything inside. Well, it would have to, yes. This is wrong. I might be able to just do this and fix it without any fuss. I think I can. Okay, great. Okay, great. There we go. Cool. Okay, that's our mirror intro. Let's go here. Uh, okay, so just one space, plus these two elbow pipes. Horizontal mirror only. I mean, this is just a matter of uh, doing the same thing I just did, basically. Right? Yeah, this is the same thing as last puzzle, only simpler, it seems like. Um, except I keep mixing up my, uh, my ups and downs. Oh no, this is differently shaped. So I need to put you in the... Ah, gotcha. So I have to mirror this so that I can put this in from that side. Then having inserted it like that, I mirror it again. But on the inside, you're going to be the wrong way around, so I need to mirror you first. Okay, that's what's going on here. Ah, uh, that's great. Okay, now everything should be good. <laughs> okay, not the same puzzle at all. Something much more. Okay, let's uh, do these two and unlock the gate. How about that? Mirrored pointer, unmirrored real thing. Okay. So mirrored pointer gets me in there and I think I wanna, what does this do? What did that do? Well, it mirrored the recursive instance, and doing this is blocked! Oh, I'm pushing against myself! But I can do that and then exit and... Okay, so I created a mirrored recursion instance by putting it through the mirrored pointer. Okay. Uh, um... Yeah. So, something needs to come out here. You need to mirror with this, able to exit, which it just is. There's probably some reason I don't want to have done what I just did. But it doesn't look like it to me. This seems straightforward, right? I just do that, put you down here, and exit. Yeah, that's the whole thing. Okay. Great. All right, next world's unlocked, and I'll finish this one next time. I'll see you then.